my name is Jennifer Smith from the Coping with Depression blog at HealthyPlace.com. And I'd like to wish you all a happy holiday. And I'd also like to talk to you today about some gift ideas for those in your life who have been diagnosed with depression. Uh, since I myself have that diagnosis, I thought that sharing some things that I like would benefit you and give you just some thoughts if you're having any struggles trying to decide on a gift for your loved one. Uh, first of all, as the days and nights of winter grow longer, drearier, and colder, um, one thing that I struggle with is um, having just, you know, very cold feet. And when my feet are cold, that just makes the rest of me cold and uh, tends to make me feel worse for some reason if I'm having a bad day with my depression. Um, so one thing I like to make sure to do is to keep my feet warm. And um, I do that by some nice pairs of slippers. Uh, this is one of my favorite pairs. It's just a very simple style, just little ballet flat slippers. Um, of course, you know the person whom you're buying for, so you can decide on what kind of style would best suit that person. Um, another thing I'll do if I don't feel like wearing slippers is wear some fuzzy, warm socks. Also, I like to choose bright colors because they do kind of add a little cheeriness to the bleakness that often comes during the winter months. And can also exacerbate um, our struggles with depression. Uh, something else that's a good gift idea for someone with depression is a planner. And this is uh, the planner that I have. Mine is, um, you know, again, the cover suits me. It's my personality, but again, that's a preference choice for uh, your loved one. But what this helps me do, because uh, so often, with depression, um, my memory uh, doesn't always work in the way that it uh, used to. So this helps me just remember important dates, like if I have appointments with doctors, um, I can even schedule in here just reminders for my medicine, um, just reminders if I'm gonna get together with a friend, if I have a writing deadline. And of course, yes, we do have our phones uh, for that kind of thing now, but sometimes, at least for me, it helps me to see it in a tangible writing format. And also it helps me to just take a pen sometimes and just write things out with my hand rather than just type them. So a planner can really help uh, that person in your life who battles depression uh, to, to stay organized and to feel like they can be more in charge of their lives. Um, also, something else that I like to do is to just keep a journal of uh, what am I struggling with, what have, uh, what have I had victories with, and uh, these are just a couple of different styles that I have in uh, my journal ideas. So a journal is a nice gift also for the, your loved one with depression. Um, finally, just quickly, um, if, if your loved one with depression collects anything in particular, um, buying them another piece in that collection would be great. Um, as you can see, my collection is um, nutcrackers. So uh, when someone gives me another nutcracker, that means a lot to me. So once again, I just want to say happy holidays to everyone. And I am Jennifer Smith from the Coping with Depression blog at HealthyPlace.com.